floodlights are on and everyone is ready here at Turf Moor. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Burnley up against Arsenal. Maxwell Cornet and number 27, Matai Vitra. And this confrontation is underway. possibilities inside the box excellent assessment of the situation at the back but well, Arsenal badly want to win this game after drawing in the last match against Chelsea what do you expect on this occasion Stuart well sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game Gendouzi and danger still Cuts it back. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Gendouzi. Can he put them in front? Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Vidra. Lennon. Dale Stevens has it. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Gendouzi. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and might be a chance here. And there it is, the opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge and it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. And this ordering off could mean the end of their push today. Well, there's no way back now. He's really let his teammates down here. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Well, the half-time whistle fast approaching. It's Arsenal with the lead. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts on their performance so far. Well, they've won. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? Off and running again as we reflect upon an eye-catching first-half display from Arsenal. I think he'll fit in well to their style of play. He's a skillful player, but the move will just bring out the best of him. It's a good signing for both him and the club. Could be! And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Who can he pick out? Not really the ideal clearance. Not to be advised, giving the ball away in that position. He's going forward well here. This looks more than decent. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Trying to pick out a teammate. And off the crossbar. Well, he must have thought that was in. Real chance. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target. And they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. This looks threatening. There it is. The goal. Keep coming, no stopping them today. Oh, 
Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, but then there's still plenty to do afterwards. We have to say it's a really nice finish just to guide it into the net. That's a lovely goal. And threading it forward. Can he finish this? He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Nketiah, chances on. There it is. Victory more or less guaranteed now. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And then through on goal, he just goes for... And the reports have been confirmed. He has decided to end what's been a brilliant career at the end of this season. A huge loss for the club, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, what a player he's been, and still is. But he obviously thinks his body can't cope anymore. Oh, Stuart, they could be in here. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. On they go again. And Arsenal know they need to wipe out that last goal. Oh, good vision. It is a decent-looking attack here. Well, it took a deflection. That'll be a corner. And there's the delivery. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Oh, it might be. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. And news of a goal at Goodison Park. Alex Scott has the details for us. Will it be? Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Martin Odegaard. Can they take advantage? And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Serge Gnabry oh he's through here and look at that a goal here for Arsenal who now have got themselves on terms well here we can see it again look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself while the movement in the box is equal to it it's such good timing what a goal Tierney and players waiting at the far post. Here's Gabriel Jesus. Has a go! Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Superb block. Might take the lead. Well, flinging himself at it. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. He to develop his career. This looks promising. And then... Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end, but you still have to be in the right place, keep your composure and finish it off, and that's exactly what he did. So there we have it, 2-1. A 
And a throw in it's going to be. Tielemans. Gabriel Jesus. Gnabry. And that wasn't a million miles away. Almost the equaliser. Well, it's not a bad effort, is it? But they've got to find a way back into this one. And we have more live Premier League action coming up for you soon on EA TV. It's Wolves taking on oh, Liverpool. Derek, can he finish it here? Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top-class save. He's trying to create something. And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, it's the perfect finish, isn't it? As you can see, you can't place it better than that, can you? In what will be a tough encounter. Into the final 20 minutes. Tielemans. Jesus. And momentum is with them. Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. On they go again. And that goal for Arsenal means they can now entertain thoughts of perhaps drawing level. Well, I'm hearing a change to the scoreline in the Everton game. Alex Scott can tell us more. Yeah, it's a third goal for Manchester City. It's now 3-1 with 76 minutes played. Must score. Oh, there it is. This is astonishing stuff. Now they find themselves level here. Martin Odegaard. And with the teams locked together... Arsenal chased super goalkeeping in such a tight game. Well, he's just kept them in this. Brilliant goalkeeping, that is. Let's see about the delivery. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Good vision. Can he get onto this? And he could cash in. For Dance. Must take the lead here. Really important tackle. And just five minutes remaining. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Now a decent position. The delivery. And what a magical save it was! Well, this corner could be pivotal. It might represent the last chance to get in front in the dying moments. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Wang Hee Chan. Can he finish? Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. Martin Odegaard. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. 
Nelson Semedo. Two players waiting in the middle. However, up a dead end. Foiling them effectively. And with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Stuart, your analysis. Well, it could have gone either way. Probably the fair result. For the campaign, the action is next on EA TV. And welcome to the eastern part of England. We find ourselves at Carrow Road. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And we have FA Cup action to bring you from the round of 16, just moments away. It is Norwich City, and they take on Arsenal. Yes, cheers, Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in they're the underdogs, but if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. Let's hope they do that today. Well, this game should offer plenty. Arsenal get it going. And he prevented it from going over the line. Now, will the cross work out for them? Attending to his defensive chores. Sergeant. A bit of running room now on the wing. Sends it back. Touch off the defender last of all, so a corner. Played over. And first class defending cleared off the line. Les Miru. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. So the game restarted by Arsenal. A wake-up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? Serge Gnabry it needs an accurate cross the inside route looks promising always going to be the goalkeeper's ball keeper not concentrating this could be the equaliser but oh what an important save how about that well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. And he's fired over the corner. Taking care of business defensively here. Tielemans. Well, the bar. quality defending well they get themselves level here able to close down the shot wonderful tackle Gnabry oh crucial tackle brilliant well that'll be a free kick just now about taking one of those chances to get back into the game now can they create something Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Let's see about the delivery. 
Well, he couldn't get the header on the target, but you've got to give credit to the defending. Serge Gnabry. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Luka Jovic. Could be. And it's gone in. Beyond the goalkeeper. Arsenal level. So, a level contest. 1-1. And the referee... ...the managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Later to the box. Not really the ideal clearance. catch it perfectly and didn't he just well when you see this again the defending just isn't good enough the clearance doesn't get enough height on it doesn't get enough distance on it and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area and they don't reorganize themselves and that's why the ball's in the back of their net Really feisty affair. Might be able to get in behind the defence. And it's gone in! The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. So back underway at 3-1. Serge Gnabry. Well, it stopped a promising attack in its tracks. And you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Well, that's how to take a free kick, but no goal in the end. Please share it. Please make yourself known to the nearest two. Thank you. Tielemans, not to be, and still chasing this game. Well, that was the chance to get back into this. As it is, they're going to struggle now. Still pushing forward with options available. And that is the sort of tackle he had scripted in his mind. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Promising possession, this. A danger here as he runs at them. A really top-notch piece of defending. Will it be? Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, good defending. Looking for the right moment. Opportunity. Just a matter of thumping it away. And promising stuff from Arsenal. And let's give credit to the defending. Byram. Grant Hanley with it. And now back with the keeper. Janulis. Norman. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? 
Well, not the first time he's been in trouble with the law in this game, and now it's a booking. You're absolutely right. He's committed too many fouls. He deserves the yellow card for that. An incisive pass. Oh, he's missed it. And that might be their fate sealed. They've got it now. What can they do? Arsenal's free kick here. And the ref, well, no surprise to see him go for goal, but a routine save in the end. Loftus cheek. Well, it must be mighty annoying when you can't get near the ball. The home fans are jubilant. They are going through. Yeah, it was a good overall display, especially up front, where their clever movement and combination play cause lots of problems. They'll certainly fancy their chances going into the next round. Well, it's normal to have high expectations where Milot Rashica is concerned, Stuart. What did you make of the part he played? Well, he scored a good goal. 